I'd rather run stuff that I like I have a personal attachment to and I'm interested in and enjoy than like just something that just had a lot of people. The original Battlefield or Battlefront 2 would be um kind of fun honestly. And there is actually like a community around that, so I could um I don't know, it'd be interesting to uh potentially like talk to people about the game and like learn stuff from other people if that makes sense. But I don't know how active people are in the Discord. Although there was a, like if people seem pretty like passionate about it. And there's like there's quite a lot of people that have run that game. We'll find Protectorate Gleb in the archives. It's like actually pretty well established, which is kinda cool. Makes me happy. I mean, even something like that, though, I don't think I'd be competitive in. Sadly, I'm not. I'm not a raw, talented gamer. <laughs> I'm all right. <laughs> I'm all right. I'll see if this fixes it. If not, I'm gonna restart the game. I don't think it will fix it, but you never know. The storm is too much. What do we do? I don't think there's anything we can do. Not at least. Special forces, let them through. Right, bitch. Special forces. <sighs> but don't worry, we're gonna rebel and join the fucking rebellion. We're losers. Is a really good boost. That was an amazing boost. I was like god tier. Saying being a good guy slash rebel is a loser. Ah, uh, no. Maybe. <laughs> Bad guys are so much cooler, man. I don't know. Ooh, that was pretty good. That's pretty good. There's a passageway on the other side of the plaza. We're too exposed. Nah, I didn't fix it. We have to reach the corpse and get out of Imperial space. It's our only chance. I'll restart the game after this round then. Then we This is very bad. Keep it together, Agent Nico. We have civilians on the This is a good run though. We don't have Imperial comms anymore. The Corvus won't even know we're coming. We'll figure it out. Letting them pass unharmed. That was gracious. We don't need to kill everyone we see. Come on. We can shut down the anti-air systems ahead. Not a great run so far. There's been a couple small things, but oh, I missed that jump too. This way. Stay quiet. They won't see us coming. Understood. Wait for my mark. That's not bad though. Are there any good guys you like more than bad guys? David Tennant is Doctor Who? Yes, Commander. I'm with you. No matter what they say. Um, Han Solo? ATST. I see the anti air cannons. Clone troopers. There's a couple options. There you go. There's a couple. There's a couple. And the bad guy list? Well, you were asking for ones that... I mean, bad guys are, like, undeniably cooler. Let's be honest. Right? They're undeniably cooler. 
but they are bad, so it's kind of like, you know, a little bit of a toss-up. They're cooler, but they're also bad guys, and they do bad things, and that's not good. So, a toss-up. But, you gotta admit they're cooler. I mean, a fucking Mon Calamari cruiser or a Star Destroyer. Like, come on. Come on. It's kind of a no-brainer. Like, that's not even a choice. Like, that's... that's... Who the fuck likes a Mon Calamari cruiser? That shit's lame as fuck. <laughs> It just looks like a big, long, like, potato. Or, like, a lumpy baguette. Just lame. I mean, even the Corvus in front of her, or in front of us, is... Yeah, it looks cool. TIE Fighters! TIE Fighters I could go without. TIE Fighters aren't that cool looking. I think baguettes are lame. Oh no, baguettes are... Baguettes are tasty as fuck. Ooh. This should die on the next shot. Nice, this actually could be... This actually could be the run. It won't be amazing, but depending on what this time is, it could be the run. And I did say I'd accept it if it was a PB, even if I'm not super happy with it. It'll be one second. I mean... Because we're pretty much not going to lose any time. This part's really hard to lose time. There should be a one second PB. Obviously. Gotta wait and see, but it should be. This part's pretty static. God, this FOV is so bad. You can't even shoot things properly because the FOV fucks up the scope too. <laughs> Surfing. I can't even see the enemies because the dot above their head is so big. From final test to see the goal first, it's fully cemented. Another unit inbound. Well, I do feel like I can do better. One second, one second isn't ideal. But I did say I would accept it. I can always come back and revisit the level later, right? I'm not really sure if I did anything that wrong, though. I'd want to look at my sum of best. Or, like, my best segments to kind of compare. I mean, the first part's good. I mean, getting any kind of boost that's, like, that level is good. And then getting, you know, a little bit of time save on the running is, like, pretty good, honestly. The AT... Oh, the at, -AT though. Only getting 0 0.1 second on that's really not that great. Technically a PB. Not by much, though. Not by much. Technically. 
Alright, so... I'll keep trying for today. But, if I don't get anything better today... What is this? Then... A bad egg. We'll move on, and we'll accept it. We'll accept it. Um, I just, I feel like the walker bit can be so much better. Like, 0 0.1 second for the ATST bit is just like... <laughs> that's just nothing like that could be two seconds like i don't understand how that was only 0 0.1 like i killed the walker fast too but to be fair something i do need to realize is the sum of best like now that i think about it the sum of best are going to be off by 0 0.4 at most right so i do kind of need to give it that leeway so, I mean, maybe I just fucked it up one time. Maybe the walker can't be that much better, right? Because that was kind of really good, but... So, I'll try again for today. If we don't get anything better, we'll accept that run. Um, I'm not super happy with it, but... Because I did make some mistakes. But... I will accept it if we don't get anything better today. 